Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to Sandy Bay, episode two. Farmer Joe's joined us, and I just noticed a cat. What you doing, kitty? Apparently climbing that fence nice and slowly. Oh, you found a mouse on top? Yeah. Morning, Hapco. Good evening to you. <laughs> and the cat went just blazing off that fence. Cool. Well, there comes the cat again. Oh, same spot. Must be something there. Anyway, we harvested that first field yesterday. We are going to plow and seed it right now. <coughs> After we're done playing with our cat. Okay, let's put that weight up front. Don't know if it really needs it, but we have the weight. Yeah, it is nighttime here, but we just woke up. Um, I work graveyard shift, so for me this is morning. I know, it's confusing. It's uh, 1.30 a.m. Don't want to smoke that. I don't like this plow at all. <clears throat> well, we got to suffer with it. Got a lot of loan to pay off. So, I'll start plowing. <clears throat> Cut through the cattle pasture. Seeing we don't have any cattle yet, I'm sure they don't mind. <clears throat> and apologies right up from start from clearing my throat. I've got quite a sore throat. Yeah, I uh, saw you had a video up. <clears throat> um, it was a little bit laggy, but that's, I think, due to your uh, the size of your computer. But it did work well. <clears throat> I gave it a thumbs up. Why, why are we going to go into debt even more? Oh, you're going to buy seed and fertilizer. <clears throat> I am minus 800. <clears throat> hey, we didn't go to the minus. Collected enough straw that stayed in the positive. Well, subtract that huge loan. Oh, uh, I forgot how long this little plow takes to plow a field. I believe the whole episode is going to be plowing field. I think. Uh, pick anything. No, you don't get. You only get straw from wheat and barley. Do we have barley? We don't have any barley either, so you can plant barley. Yeah, but by the time we want to sell, who knows what price it is? I'd say go barley. That way, we can sell the straw as well. <coughs> That'd be my choice, but whatever you would like. Not a big deal. Well, there's actually three fields we can plant right now. Yeah, two fields we could harvest right now. <coughs> so 
So I guess that means we start with five fields with crops on them and then a couple of grass fields. Although the cattle pasture counts as a crop field. You know, I think there might be enough grass at the end of these fields that I can just start going GPS here. How's that going to work with... Hmm. Yeah, you can plant as soon as I've got enough plowed, you'll, then you can start planting, but it'll take a little bit before I get to that point. <coughs> if I turn the GPS on, I might do a little better job of... making as few trips up and down this field as possible. and straight right here, follow that groove. Set up this GPS. A new auto. <coughs> See if that works. Because we can't flip the plow. It makes it complicated, doesn't it? Oops. I think the offset, we still have to make the offset go automatic back and forth. do not like this plow at all. Not in the slightest.
Alright Farmer Joe, if you make your way to this end of the field, it'll be the first part that you can start planting. <coughs> Yeah. Once that's wide enough on the end over there, then you can start planting. Unfortunately, it means you'll have to do some waiting as well. Where are you right now? Ah, oh, you're at the entrance there. Seems to be right. It's not leaving anything out, so <clears throat> all good. All good. This will definitely be a very long and painful process. There, you should be able to make a, at least one pass now. <clears throat> what do you think? Should I? Uh, bite the bullet and sell this plow and buy one slightly bigger. Not much bigger, can't really afford to go into lots of that, but maybe one with a little bit wider working width. <coughs> yeah, that'd be probably the one right there, the, the Amazon carry on 200 <coughs> well I'll finish this little section here and then drive off to the store and and that one is 180 horsepower. Why don't you go to the garage and see how many horsepower this Massey Ferguson has? Uh, 210 horsepower. So, yeah, we should be able to handle that plow. <laughs> yeah, Hapco, this is definitely, definitely an ugly plow. I'll finish this little section, so and then I will run to the store and get that slightly bigger plow. It means going into more debt, but I legitimately hate this plow. I don't think I've ever played with this plow before. The cultivator is narrow, but I don't necessarily hate that one. It's just time consuming. Oops, there's a help menu. Oop, Farmer Joe is collecting an egg. Just one, apparently.
<laughs> I think you have better luck saving some money than uh, winning the lottery, but... Finish this and then uh, pirate for life. That is very funny because I'm a bit of a pirate myself. How much money do I have into a pirate costume? Over over two thousand dollars into a pirate costume, <coughs> and my wench is dressed up as a pirate as well. Farmer Joe and I dress up as pirates and do uh, charity charity collecting money for charities dressed up as pirates. It's it's quite fun. Um, how do I get to the chop the easiest way? Let's go through the farmyard down that way. Okay. Yikes! <laughs> Almost hit that gate. There's our cat. Can't believe I didn't notice that on the first episode. <clears throat> Drove by that quite often. I see our fish in that water there. Shop is this way. Oh yeah, there's our snake. Eleven grand out of that, and the new plow was twenty-two grand. So Oop, I don't want to repay loan. I want to make a bigger loan, twenty-two grand back. Bye. Yes. Okay. There we go. We've got a new plow. Oh, much better. Much, much better. Glad I got that wheel weight up front, because, or not wheel weight, but the weight up front. This plow needs that weight. Try to take out that 
that road sign. Does fold up. Cool. I've never owned this plow either, so. Oh, I see our duck there, on the left hand side in the water. careful around all these corners. It's a tight laneways everywhere. Let's unfold this sucker. See what you can do. That should do the trick. Like hitting that auto one more time when you're in GPS mode. Sometimes it straightens it out a little bit more. <clears throat> yeah, this is much, much better. And this plow I can flip over on the end of the field. It'd be very handy. Yeah, the, this game at the current price oh, is crazy. Yeah, we, uh, we purchased it on a sale price. It was way, way, way down in price, but... I know it's uh, $44 Canadian. Way, way, way overpriced, in my opinion. Love this game, but I would not spend that much money into the game. I'm going to do another round around the field with this plow. I need a little more room at the ends. GPS off for now. Yeah. <clears throat> I definitely recommend people, if you're on PC and Steam, put on your wish list and keep an eye on it. Wait for good sale because it is expensive.
there. on again. All right. Let's see if that was enough room for me to turn around at the ends. It's a nice plow. Only a 700 kilogram weight, but it seems to be doing the trick. I might have to do another round around the field because there's still not quite enough room. That should give us plenty of room now. Yeah, I was hoping the game would uh, go on a really good sale and I'd buy an extra copy. It'd be a great giveaway. But at its current price, not gonna happen. Especially since off of uh, YouTube I make a whole dollar a month. <laughs> so uh, it would take a while to pay off that game. Keep missing little bits. Alright, that should be lots of room. So as always, we keep our episodes to about half an hour. We always stream live a long time after that. Sandy Bay will be played probably two times a week or so. So thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, hit that thumbs up. Thanks for watching. We will see you next time.